Vista. If you look, Center City is nine blocks that way. So we are on the 900 block in South Philly. How it's determined is Market Street in Philadelphia splits Philadelphia north to south. Um, so if you look up, you see the 800 on top of the 12. I don't mm -hmm. know if you guys can see yeah. that, but yeah. that means we're eight blocks from Market Street. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, so eight blocks from dead center city where all the money is, you know, all the business. Mm -hmm. You know, that's that's where everything happens in Philadelphia. We're only working as far out as like 15 blocks from okay. dead center that's city. Right. That's the we, farthest you'll work that's out? That's the farthest we're, we're at now. Oh. We're experimenting right now about 17, 18 blocks out, but I'm not selling that because I'm a, I am establishing what we can get for stuff. Nice. We own property 17 blocks out, but we're trying to see what we can get. We, we're, we're like six, eight months ahead of our investors. Nice. Testing, mm -hmm. testing, see what we can get. Um, basically, we're about to cross Broad Street. Broad Street splits Philadelphia east to west. So this is East Philadelphia, East South Philly, Southeast. This is Southwest. Right down here is Center City, Billy Penn. I mean, that's City Hall. You know, that is our our. That's nice. Yeah, that's, that's a, a nice view there. Yeah. Okay. This is an area here. Now we're going to head towards Graduate Hospital. Graduate Hospital, I don't know if you ever heard of Toll Brothers. They're a publicly traded builder, very huge company. Uh, they did a big project at, called the Naval Yard up here, high-end townhomes. And it started a wave that came this way. Fifteen years ago, this neighborhood was really bad. Mm -hmm. It was crazy. What was it called again? This is a Graduate Hospital. No, I mean the neighborhood back then, you called it something, the devil's... No, no, that, that, oh, that was back that's All where right. we're going to be going. Okay, if you look at the doors here, you see the real estate, it's it's starting to look fancy. Mm -hmm. People are starting to put money into this area. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's actually a $990,000 comp on this block. What does that mean? You, the, for the city, as far as the city goes? No, as far as a, a sold unit, a comp, a comparable unit. Oh, okay. Oh, so, oh, okay. these buildings here with the gray... Yeah. They are they're sold nine hundred and sixty thousand. Oh, so they're four story elevated. They're ridiculous. I mean they're, they're like a million almost a million? Nine sixty. Uh -huh. They have elevators, four hundred you know, nice, they're, they're huge. Four stories. They just built that one. Um they're you know, you'll see. I just You'll see what's going on here. I mean there's just so, so is it like if you take one block in this neighborhood, would you say um, one or two or three of, out of every ten houses is has already been converted in this neighborhood. Yeah, seventy percent, eighty percent done. Okay. We don't really work here too much because there's not a lot of inventory left. Yeah, because look how close you are to the city. Yeah, yeah. that's I mean, nice. This is big money here. Yeah, that's this a, area. Is very, you can walk to the city. You can right? walk to the city. It's very desirable. You got seven hundred thousand dollar townhomes mixed in here. Mm -hmm. These are all new. They're about a year and a half, two years old tops. In in the hot market, they were 700 grand. So they're they're you know you got this area here. What's that church down there? Um, I forget the name of it. It looks old. It is old though. It's very old. <laughs> I sold a shell on this street. It was a movie set. It had one wall. Really? I'm going to show it to you for 185 thousand. A 250 thousand dollar rehab. It's a free family, and uh, it's worth about uh, 600k. If you look, see how see the area, how it's popping. Mm -hmm. You got new bump outs. You got you know, I sold this house here. Okay, it didn't have see all that new in the back. Yep. It didn't have any of that. I sold that front wall for 185,000. And now it's up to 600. Well, two after they put 250 rehab. in it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's, okay. that's good. Now we're we're back. We're going left here. We're going south. Look what's happening in this neighborhood. New construction, new construction, new construction. There's no shortage of people building here. These houses are about 400,000, 450. Okay, this neighborhood is commanding in the mid fours right now. Uh, you got over here uh, 19 new units going in here. There's 11 of them under contract, 459 a piece. Hmm. This neighborhood is commanding in the mid fours for hmm. new stuff. Stuff hmm. like this in the threes for the rows. Mm -hmm. um, you got people getting a little fancy and they're getting a little 
little Soho-ish with different kinds of materials. Look at the building here. They're, they're, they're doing three different kinds of materials to make it fancy looking. Mm -hmm. um, there's no shortage of money being spent in this part of South Philadelphia. Would that property sell for upper four? Upper fours. Uh, we have closings around here in the mid fives, anywhere from four to six fifty. Hmm. Okay. People like these people here. They have a pool on their roof. They got a real trendy look. Oh, yeah, yeah, look how cool awesome. that is. Where? So, right here, right here. They have a pool on the roof. Real trendy. Mm -hmm. This area is double income. No kids. Single income. No kids. Moving in here. You know, they want. They're, they're, you're nine blocks from Center City. Mm -hmm. Just nine blocks. Um, there's not a lot of inventory left here to do so and it's pricey so you need a lot of money to play here when did the buildup of this start happening 12 or 24 months ago no about about um well this stuff is you know this stuff's within the last year but in like 2000 it really started oh, okay. you know what i mean about 2000 south philly started taking shape okay. um, wow, that's so basically this this neighborhood here i mean just look up the street center city is nine blocks yes okay yes. i'm going to show you now what i call the mason dixon line the mason dixon yeah, line. it's my mason dixon line right across the street over washington is where we did 125 houses in, in one zip code last year right near here yeah you know we're working very close washington avenue here is a commercial street it's very it's a double wide street so there's a lot of industrial going on a lot of construction materials being moved around here. It's just a big double wide street and it's easy for, for businesses to operate. Mm -hmm. So this is commercial. Well, no, commercial right off the like a block away from that. This is all commercial. This is Washington Avenue. We're working over here between Broad and 23rd. Okay, there's Broad is 15th. So we work like 15th to 23rd. We're working Washington out to um, Tasker. So there's like a six block square by a 10 block square that we're just, we just kill it. It's just crazy. We're flipping that neighborhood. Really? It's 50% investor owned and 50% privately owned. What do you mean by that? With the whole neighborhood? Exactly. I mean, there's actually okay. a statistic. It's the people are, they're not really buying to live in them right now? Rent, you know, investors buying rent. Rent. You know, who, the, who are the rent? Who, what's the rental market? Who, the rent, you know, a single family home is, is bringing anywhere from 1000 to 1800 a month, depending on bedroom. Well, and who's the, renting it? Yeah, yeah like, the renter profile. You know, it's, it's, it's mixed. I mean, we still do Section 8 in this area, HUD mm -hmm. housing. Mm -hmm. There's still Section 8s. Um, so it's 800, 800 to rent, uh, what, two bedroom? You can get a two bedroom for for seven hundred, and, and so I'm going to show you a unit that's going to get fifteen hundred. What percent okay. is Section Eight? Um, I don't have the exact percent, but um, you know, for investor owned, it depends where at. Like, In there's the certain streets that yeah. are for flipping, certain streets are for renting, and I'll explain that mm, to you okay. along the way.